Hey, New Egg viewers, Juan Carlos Bagnell here, and today we're diving into a game that has swept through the gaming community at large again for what seems like the hundredth time since it came out a decade ago. I am, of course, speaking about Minecraft. The reason we're playing Minecraft today is to test out real-time ray tracing on EVGA's NVIDIA RTX 2070 Super GPU. Now, this GPU is a little less beefy than the 2080 Super we already showcased with Control, but it's still a beast of a card. And if you want to see how the best possible ray tracing looks in gaming, there's a link to the video in the description below. This GPU is a hybrid card, which means it uses liquid cooling and air cooling combined. Hybrid cards like these can be a little bulky with the extra radiator, so make sure you have a big enough desktop case to fit it, especially if you're already using liquid cooling for your CPU. Minecraft is going to be getting an official RTX makeover from NVIDIA at a later date, but we're doing something a little different today. This version of real-time ray tracing in Minecraft is unofficial, and it was built using several creative solutions from independent developers and other third parties. Even though it's unofficial, it's still gorgeous, and it's the best-looking Minecraft we've seen so far. And after almost 10 years, we've seen a lot of Minecraft. We'll cover NVIDIA's official real-time ray tracing for the game when it goes live, but this is a great test run and a first look at how incredible it could look with RTX on. Setting the ray tracing up in the game was a complicated multi-step process, but once we knew what to look for, it wasn't too bad. Lucky for you, we wrote a detailed guide on the entire process to point you to each resource, download, and installation in order, which makes the whole affair a lot easier. If you're interested in setting up RTX features in Minecraft for yourself, a link to our guide is in the description below. Just a note, it is a little complicated, and one of the steps involves supporting an independent developer on Patreon for at least $10. But as you'll see in a moment, we think it might be worth that cost. Now let's get into some gameplay and let's see all the rays traced in Minecraft. Let's get this video demonetized. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Yeah, look at that. Some golden light coming right off the horizon. It's all pretty. And oh, start looking at that shadow light rays coming through the plants. <laughs> That's real nice. It is kind of ridiculous, like, how well lighting effects uh, can improve the look of a game that's sort of built on its uh, very simple aesthetic. Ah, uh, see? You make, like, a little treehouse here. Like, light clipping through all the leaves. Oh, that's so nice. Actually, I, I bet with this we could also see a good shadow of ourselves. Let's, uh, let's check this out. Right, go back here. If I run and turn, yeah, there I am. Look at that. Real time blocky person Minecraft shadow. All right, let's, uh, let's see if we can get some, some good look at a, oh, water and shadows. Look at, oh, okay, that is actually pretty trick. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, for as much fun as you might make of uh, because <laughs> it has been like since RTX came out. We're gonna go Minecraft RTX. Um, the water <laughs> looks really good. My eyes are actively rejecting this. This is the worst thing I've ever seen. This is yeah, literally unplayable. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It's fine. It's not fine, but it's fine. And, and come on, water. That's water. Really? That's. Awful. Just awful. It is hilarious now how flat and um, how, how it's a little bit more difficult to differentiate when uh, different items and, and objects in the environment when, I mean, like, this has been a perfectly functional Minecraft experience for years. It's not like this has really changed much on us, but, uh, how, how simple additional lighting, um, not how simple, how additional lighting can really perk up an older title. Okay, 
because that's the sun. I mean, who could play this? So I'm not the biggest Minecrafter, as you might have noticed, but I think there's something really valuable about the idea of supplying a game, even a game that's not known for amazing visuals, but with some better lighting information. I'm gonna throw the plug out there too. I, I spent some time personally at home playing Quake RTX, and we make jokes about older video games or Minecraft with ray tracing, her, her, her. But we shouldn't be terribly surprised when even blocky or simplistic graphics, there's a benefit to supplying better lighting information. How much harder it was for my brain to latch on to differences in the environment, how poor some of the shader information on water looked once we took away that extra RTX information. It's not a groundbreaking or a revolutionary way, you know, a completely a new way to play this game, but it is a fresh way to experience something that you're probably very familiar with and it's hard to go back. Again, you take that information away and my brain is kind of struggling with some of that location information and some of that detail information. Shadows play a huge role in where you're walking and how you're navigating that space. So I shouldn't be, but color me impressed that we can still do some really fun things and some really, uh, you can really spruce up some of this info, taking a look back at a title we're very familiar with. If you want something to tide you over until NVIDIA's official RTX makeover of Minecraft launches, this is a great option. Keep in mind though, that we used an RTX 2070 Super GPU to run this. To run any official version of RTX in games, you'll need at least a 20 series RTX card. And if you're interested in more RTX action in the meantime, NVIDIA is running a promotion right now where you'll receive a free copy of the upcoming Call of Duty Modern Warfare when you purchase an RTX 20 series GPU like the 2070 Super. For a full list of qualifying GPUs, check out the links down in the description below.